There's got to be so much green in this. Oh my god, and I'm wearing a green shirt underneath. Come on. Take two. Hello. Uh, I'm gonna try and make this quick because uh, if my husband comes in and sees me potentially filming an intro for a YouTube painting video, I may die of secondhand embarrassment and uh, ascend. So, uh, to avoid that, Hello, I'm Olivia. I like to paint stuff. This evening, I feel like starting a whole new project. This painting that you see behind me was a gift from a friend. I tend to do these like painting cover-ups where I will take an old painting, usually one that I started and just never finished, and I will repaint over it um, and completely change it, maybe all but one thing I had on there. However, this time somebody else got me a painting that is already done and is ugly. Um, and I've thought about this before with like some ugly thrift store paintings of like kind of redoing them, but never really did it. There is no plan. There is no plan whatsoever. There's just an idea. So with this, it's really ugly. Her back is just weird. She seemingly has like double D perky titties so big they are just but like where is her butt crack i don't like how abstract these flowers are i don't like the draping of the skirt at all her hair is crazy her face is crazy i scoured the internet looking for references of like women from behind now i see why like people aren't painted from behind like this is not interesting in any way she doesn't have an ear no, no ear okay I'm gonna get my markers out and just kind of sketch out some ideas. I did a poll on my Instagram and was like, should I do like fairy wings or should I do a back tattoo? Back tattoo one. Oh my gosh, stop. Get out. Are you done with the shower? Get the fuck out of here. What are you doing? I'm trying to film an intro before I start painting this thing. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Baby, I'm sorry. You do your thing. We're gonna try again tomorrow. <laughs> Let's try this again. <clears throat> I'm gonna make the recap even quicker. Me, painting, redo. There we go. My husband's asleep this time, so he's not gonna walk in on me. Modern problems, modern solutions. <clears throat> I guess uh, what I was getting at last night was what I plan to do with it. I put a poll on my Instagram, berry wings or back tattoo. Back tattoo won by like double the votes. And at first I was feeling it. I don't know, I saw some fairy wings that I was just like super into and I thought would make for a really interesting composition. Um, I don't know. I might be able to do both. I'm just gonna start like maybe sketching a little bit and just kinda see where things take me. Let's vandalize this thing.
Phase one complete. I think the wings look super sick. I think it complements the shape of the whole canvas, like going long ways, because you know, it just felt like she was just stuck right in the middle there and no kind of outward flowing anything. This really like brings your eyes that way, brings your eyes that way. Just and there's a science to it, but I'm no scientist. I think this just might work. My husband's still not awake. Or he is, and he's just on his phone. I guess I'm gonna start painting it. Yeah, why not, right? Might as well dive in, so. I am ready to paint some more. My client today canceled her appointment and that's fine. I'm not mad about it. My husband is at work, so I have the whole house to myself. Oh yeah. I'm realizing like, if a fairy is strolling in her fairy garden, there needs to be a bigger garden than this. There needs to be more flowers. There needs to be more life. We're gonna grow a garden today. Yeah. <laughs> destroying this marker. So I think it's time to get some yellow paint out. Do it that way.
So I've been messing with this painting and I've been painting some flowers in there but there are a couple spots that I'm not I'm not loving. So I need to take a break. I need to get up, like tidy stuff up around the house, take a breather, fold some towels. This is my I'm going to go fold towels outfit. On my days off I change my outfit like three times, maybe four times. I'm just going with the mood. If you came to watch this video expecting a fully finished painting at the end, so did I. <laughs> Ideally, when I started making this video, I was like, it's going to be like 40 minutes long and it's going to be the whole painting. You know, I'm going to start it and finish it. But the reality is that paintings like these take me months. Paintings of this size are something that I really tend to pick up and put it back down because although the idea is there, sometimes it takes time for it to fully form. And also, aside from that, this canvas sucks. It eats paint. And when it comes to acrylics, when you want a painting to look really interesting, have a lot of depth, have a lot of colors that are really beautiful to look at you really have to do layers and layers and layers and layers it's not like oils where a lot of the work comes from blending with acrylics blending isn't as simple the real work is in just the layering and layering and layering and that's why it takes so long to do something like this also i figured that you know i would at least have the flowers done by the end of this video but i'm fine with it there are certain flowers that really aren't fully formed yet i would need to use some reference to kind of get them really right i don't want to just paint useless blobs i really want to get things right in this so if that requires me just waiting a week or two before I go back into it. That's what it requires. Also, I have a full-time job. I have a husband. I have a life. I have friends. And, you know, I'm not, I'm not holed up in my room painting all the time. And that's a good thing. I create at my own free will. And that's that. If you made it this far in the video, I would just like to say thank you. If you would like to see more of this painting coming together or other type of artistic videos, you know, leave a comment or something. Throw some encouraging words my way because I could see this being a fun hobby as far as putting this video together. It was fun and I learned a lot of things. I think we all see my progression from the beginning to now and that that's kind of fun. Again, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you have a great week. I hope that you get out there and create just to create. So, bye.